Right. So let's troubleshoot the uh, one of the issue. So Hana is not starting up here. Okay. So let me clear. So sorry, we have one of the database like Triple R ADM Triple R. So when you are going to start the Hana database, let's check the database is up and running. No, database is not running here. So when you go to here, just click on the HDB star. So just start the database. You are trying to start the database. Okay. So database is getting started now. So what will happen here while starting? It will always check the so OS level file systems, OS level file systems and everything. Hana starting time, it will check the file systems and everything. Slash na data, slash na log, slash na shade, whether binaries are exist or not. Whatever we discussed in the yesterday's class, right? File systems and folders, it will check. So you see, Daimon is not running. Daimon is not running, right? So in this case, we need to troubleshoot this issue, right? Daimon is not running. Suppose if someone asks you, so what uh, can you tell me the any one of the issue? Then in this case, we can tell this issue like diamond is not running. Diamond is so not running here. Diamond is not running. Or uh, when you are starting the HANA database, HANA database is not coming up. Due to so some other internal process is not starting. It's not started. Diamond also will not start it here, right? HANA is not starting up. Sir, so where to check this logs and error messages and everything here? So if you go to uh, CD trace 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 directory trace directory is the one common location right for the all the uh, all the process related logs it will be displayed here let's check the diamond trace so what it exactly is saying here right so tail command so last thousand lines i am just accepting so this is the thousand you are, you are doing here so you can see the some error messages here network listener something like uh, listening listening it's pending so bound something like that so persistency layer, so triple R ADM fit. So name server is going down, right? Name server, that's right. So requested fit the name server. So we can see the some logs here, right? We can see the some logs and everything. We can see it here, right? So which means something the persistency layer got something is happened here. The persistency layer got something is happened here, right? because each and everything we can find out here so first of all name server is not coming up name server is not coming up here so you can see name server name server name server name server is not coming up here right so that may be so let's check the name server log file here to find out what's happening here right name server log file here so just open the so thousand lines just check the name server related log file here so let's see what happening with the name server here, right? Let's see what's happening with the, the name server here. So name server, name server, let's see what's happening with the name server here. So here, <coughs> so yeah, I can see here the persistency startup error. The persistency startup error. Persistency layer means, so in the HANA, Persistency memory means RAM memory. The persistency memory means RAM memory here, right? So persistency memory means RAM memory. So persistency memory means RAM memory here, right? Persistency layer means, so it's a, so data folder and log folder here, right? So data folder, log folder here, slash ana, so data, slash ana data and slash ana log folder here these two log folders are very important here for every so every hana database these two are very important so just coming down persistence startup error so you can have the exceptions and you see here trying to open the existing existing persistence log value but the file system does not exist the file system does not exist so that's the reason it's throwing the error right so let's see whether this really exists or some, some permission issues or what. Let's see here. So we have, no, this is not exist here. No, this is also not exist, right? So, so this is also not exist. So this is also not exist. So this is also not exist. Even slash and log is not exist. First of all, log directory got removed by someone. Or, so let's see here what happened here. So this is a training system, right? Maya, yeah, I think yes, right. So see here, 
the log directory every hana database got will not start up why because the log directory got removed by someone yesterday right log directory got removed by someone right so here you can see the log directory they got removed log directory got removed here right that's the reason so we got this issue right so which meet so log directory removed and uh, so databases will not start in this host here in this host databases will not start it here so that's the reason so we are unable to start the database as well any database in this host so in the real time what will happen no one delete in the real time so sometimes maybe real time also someone delete unexpectedly or unfortunately or fortunately something so but knowingly or unknowingly we may delete it he will so forcefully otherwise uh, maybe the file system got unmounted because these are the mounted file systems so this is maybe the unmounted so we can use the mount command mount mount type and a it we can mount the all the file systems and all those things we can mount it then we can we can clean up we can mount it and we can we can do the so we can start up the systems here right so that's the thing here this is the way we can identify the issues so log trace directory is the very very important directory to troubleshoot the issues okay trace directory is the very important directory to troubleshoot the any issues so anything so we want to find out here the trace directory we can find out right so let's check so what happened here who executed that rm command rm command so might be <clears throat> someone maybe they have executed rm command or something but because rm command only rm command only they may execute it so that may be the reason so no, we cannot find out why because so here the multiple things we will log in and we are doing something here so that's unable to find but here last command last means so last last means here we can find out who logged in with what date and everything so last is the command to find out who logged in yesterday i think yesterday up to yesterday morning that's fine but today only right maybe so yesterday morning to till date so something is happened in the system right so yesterday, oh, sorry Ravi, i might have missed it what happened someone deleted the log directory hana slash hana log they got deleted so which caused the so someone deleted that one which caused the issue which causing means which we are unable to restart we are unable to start the any hana databases because of log directory got rationed so we are troubleshooting the issue so just i am showing how to check the logs and everything in case of any issues that's what i am troubleshooting now sir even uh, if the log directory is fully occupied also we may face the issue right yes but here even they have it's not there even we have the enough free space yes yes one eighty GB is there, but it's not starting up. So because of the log directory got removed. If you see, go to the slash ana. So in the slash ana, there is no log directory. So it's got deleted yesterday. Yesterday only it got deleted. No okay, sir. Yeah. So this is the way we have to identify the issues by checking the log files.